the end. Our vest is complete. We've got all of our awesome eyelets in there. Everything is good and reinforced and ready uh, to be laced up. Uh, one thing I wanted to mention about the eyelets. So, you know, I did have this tool here I talked about. This was, you know, originally for putting in eyelets for fabrics. Uh, but there's another tool they, they have, and it's these setters. Um, I've got a couple of different ones that I got from Tandy Leather. Uh, they were just a little too big to set these eyelets, but they come with this driver and a little mini anvil. And generally what happens is this flanged out part will sit right here in this mini anvil, and then you'll use the driver, of course, to rounded out as these are rounded out uh, but again the eyelets i had were just a little too small for these so i had to go and uh use my fabric eyelet setter which was just fine did have to mess with the settings a little bit on this to make sure that it didn't split the backs but we got everything good and good and finished uh so with that all we have to do is just Take a bit of suede lacing. I've got these spools here of various types of lacing. And this is just some uh, suede. Uh, this is a 1 8 inch. And we're just going to go through and lace this thing up. Let's see here. How did I want to do this? You know, you can lace it up however you want. But the idea behind doing the lacing uh, for this was since he's still growing, still young, we want to be able to have the ability to adjust the sides and, and all that. So as he grows, you know, even between now and October 30th, we're not running into any issues from when I first measured them, right? We've got everything to a point where it's going to grow with him, okay? So I'm just doing first a really quick lace-up job here. This doesn't have to be permanent in how we're going to do it. But I just want to test it out, yeah? We did already throw the underlayment uh, version on them. So we know that kind of works, but you never know between now and the underlayment and now what may change. But I don't have any fear anything's going to be too crazy. Okay. Okay. Let's actually tie this. All right, so we've got the sides all tied up. Now we're gonna do the shoulder bit. think this is gonna look super cool all right so it just kind of gives you a preview of what this thing is gonna look like when it gets around his little tubby moose body <laughs> uh, so again this is the back here and this will be the front and we'll lace it up in the front as well so we'll get that on him uh, sometime a little bit later he's asleep right now because it's nighttime and he needs to grow some more uh, but we'll get this on him lace it up and we'll take some pictures to show you guys the finished product so that's it vest is complete we can set this off to the side 
At this point, all we got to do is punch the holes for our pauldron and set in all of the straps for that. So let's do that next. We'll jump on over and get this pauldron finished up.